I am at St. Matthew the Apostle Church in Randolph, located about 40 miles from New York City. It is in an area that is almost rural. It was an area of large farms, uh, now suburban. We're looking at a panning shot that shows the broad expanse of grass. This is a beautiful area. It's late spring, it's morning. We hear birds in the background. I know Matthew wrote the gospel, one of the gospels, but the good news for people who live here is that they can afford to live in Randolph. The architecture is modern. I'm not sure what I think about it. It's very plain. It takes on the look of a Mediterranean building. There's a bell tower, um, plain white walls, and there's even an enclosed space that would have been typical of Mediterranean architecture with a garden in the old days, but not today, although there are some plants. The architecture is not offensive but I'm not sure how good it is. And then there's the art. There's a certain cramped style that they use that uh, portrays Jesus. It's sort of a, a modern day version of Gothic. So everything's kind of vertical and thin, um, but it's lifeless. It doesn't look like any real flesh. Um, God forbid someone looked at Christ on the cross and got excited. To a certain extent, we're limited by budget. Everything here looks like it was art produced sort of on the cheap, bought out of the catalog. And in some cases, they have just little ordinary sculptures, or rather ordinary statues that one might have in the home or outside the home in one's garden and just plunked them down in the garden here. Still, Matthew wrote one of the Gospels. He wrote about the good news. Well, the good news is that you're in Randolph. And if you can afford it, I can't think of a better place to have your family. <laughs>